Hi everyone, thank you for tuning in to IGL Codings. Uh, as you all know, we are in the month of March and March is a very special month for us at IGL because uh, it is all about Mother Earth, right? And um, with Mother Earth, right, we have arranged a special, uh, very special activity, right, which involves planting the future. Now, we'll, we'll touch in on to uh, that in a little bit, but yeah, before we go into that, right, I'm sure all of you know that at IGL Coatings, we prioritize sustainability, innovation, and uh, going green, being green, right? Uh, as you know, um, one of, we are one of the pioneers in zero uh, VOC ceramic coatings and greener products, and so we want to invite all of you to build a better tomorrow with us today not tomorrow but today we're going to do something for all of us for a better tomorrow okay with that said uh, the whole month of march and april all right we will be focused on sharing our green initiatives right uh, which is again plant the future and we want you to join us not only you please get your friends your family anyone around you the community around you to join us as well uh, and internationally i think we've shared with you uh, through email of course newsletter uh, social media and this life right the right so uh, on how you can change tomorrow today uh, one of the many ways is by spreading awareness so don't forget right to add the plant the future filter uh, plant the future filter into your profile picture uh, and to just to spice things up right we'll be choosing three lucky winners right three lucky winners uh, to win a limited edition uh, IGL t-shirt okay so very very interesting stuff coming up um, so if you want to switch your profile feature to add this feature right just go on to the comment section below uh, there'll be links there for you just click on to it and just boom change it right just spread the awareness that's the least we can do for mother nature right okay so as for today's live session we have a very special activity and we have a very special guest right and it is to make your very own seed pots right seed pots is called seed pots yeah and this is called uh, this is what we call the plant uh, the future initiative right so as part of our campaign we are giving away uh, more than 5,000 trees to plant in Malaysia and that is just Malaysia right and it's all about uh, it's all made from IGL boxes right so you have all your um, you know all your kits right your eco code kits all those boxes will be reused again and to make all this seed pot so yeah talk about recycling we're doing that so <laughs> not only that uh, but each seed pot is handmade personally by a mother right so it's literally from one mother to another you get it right so from one mom to mother nature right <laughs> right so these seeds are made by a social enterprise in malaysia right it's very interesting i just found out about them uh, they empower mothers in asia and they are known as mom village asia mom's village asia am i right okay so joining us today is the ceo of mom's village asia uh and guys again please help me welcome please give a big hand although we can't be physically together right? please give a, please give a big hand virtually to rosalind hi rosalind thanks for having me here <laughs> okay, we want to really know, right, why or how you started uh, this whole initiative uh, and what's your background like uh, and, and why is it important that, that we kind of take this seriously? Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you for that awesome question because introducing ourselves is going to be taking long. I hope all of you are ready. Don't worry, I'll try to make you shorter, okay? <laughs> and Mom's Village Asia is actually a, a partnership a social enterprise. Uh, my partner's name is Vatsala Nair Manoharan, but she's not available today because uh, she has to handle a few things. And uh, so sorry for that. We really wish we could do it together. So here, what happens? How did this partnership of uh, social enterprise Mom's Village Asia started was me and Watts. We know each another through virtual. We were working with our community, especially with women who wants to rebuild their life to do something. So in this situation, our beneficiaries are domestic violence victims or women who wants to actually start something on their own, but wondering what do they do? 
So here is where Watts was dealing a lot with those women who goes through a trauma in their life. How do they actually rebuild their lives so that they can be financial independent and they'll be able to make their own decision, whether whatever the decision can be. But the moment they are financial independent, the decision comes easy for them. So in another way, I am a digital marketing trainer, mentor and coach. I have been doing this for the past 12 years also. Wow, that sounds so old. Okay, and I used to, <laughs> and I coached this woman to start their business online, entrepreneurship, marketing in all the social media platform, and how do they optimize this platform? So both of us was admiring each another's work, and the collaboration started with this product. The baby of Magic Seed was born when Watts came across this idea. And when she saw this gorilla farming and she said, hey, this is a very good product to have here because we are already having issues with ozone layer thinning and plants have been cutting down and, you know, there's no trees around. So we were like, okay, let's do something different. And when she came up with this idea and during that time, there was a innovation pitching that was happening under Mitra and we applied for that and she got it through. And during that time is where I deal with my second baby and I was actually on my confinement and she gave me a call and said, Rose, we are having a pitching session this week. Could you like to be my partner? Because I can't do this alone. So that, that's how the proposal happened and we got literally match made in heaven. And today we have been running it for the past three years and from just a soil seed form, we grew until innovating a lot of product and other moms village doing magic seed is a brand that we do for sustainability because that's what we're talking about right sustainability so the business can sustain by itself and we encourage everyone who's having celebration to give this as a gift because when you give something when you give sweets right go to wedding you see sweets yeah. type it in the rice now let's give something <laughs> so you can give plant it out and grow it as a tree you save your environment you save your health and you also teach your children the future generation that how important is mother nature so that's what we do in the magic set and also adding on to that right we do a lot of training for whoever wants to start business from home we do a lot of training for them we can help we hand hold them until we journey. Actually, we don't let them go la, unless they tell us, you know what, we are enough with your coaching. So we have a big community that's been going on under Facebook, Home Empowerment Network, where I have uh, sellers, buyers, as well as people who come together with the same mindset. Okay, the next question, right, uh, that I wanted to ask you, right? Uh, Magic Seed or Seed Pot, right, is one of the, the, the key products, right? But why, what, why did you guys choose Magic Seed? Or why, why did you guys choose Seed Point? Why is it important for that? Interesting question. Again, back to Mother Nature. We wanted to reduce the waste and we were thinking about how do we, uh, paper especially, as you all know, all of us love using paper. Thank you. And the kids love papers. All the mothers will actually tell you yes. Every time to write one line, I need an A4 paper. And then the paper probably would not be completed. They need another paper. There's a lot of wastage that's been going on. And most of the time we throw it. And then you are getting, so there is, there is no recycle on that part. And then what happened when we move from soil bomb, which we used to make to soil. And why seed is because we want to encourage children to grow. And so that they be responsible of the plant. So they know the responsibility as well. So we had a lot of thoughts into creating this soil bomb. Then when uh, we saw a lot of papers going wasted in our house itself, we thought, okay, now how do we actually uh, recycle this and make something out of that? That's where the seed paper, recycled seed paper, seed bomb was born. And we tried all the way, all the methods. Trust me, it was not as easy as just put it in and it happens. No, we had to like find the right level of water and the right level of how the paper should be in order for us to make uh, the bomb and how the seed. Every time we do a production, we will plant the seed ourselves. We will, we will make sure the seed grows and plant it to see how is it going before we actually hand over to customers because it's so important to us. And we also give guarantee. If your seed don't grow, we will send you a brand new seed. 
So this initiative was like literally thought about Mother Nature, thought about how do we use the recycled stuff that's been going for waste. How do we encourage children to be responsible for the plant? Because every time somebody buy, we always will add in this. If you have a kid, let them be responsible of the plant. Tell them you need to water the plant every day. And then they, they intend to, when the child sees something that they are doing and it's growing, the, the, they feel an accomplishment and the responsibility part is being get into them much more stronger. So all this is something that we thought about and most importantly also, how do we uh, create job opportunity for the women that we work with? And this seems to be a very uh, easy work to do, but takes a bit of time because each and every seed bomb that we send is all handmade, not machine made. I guess so many moving parts, so many things to consider. And then I think you're hitting all the right keys, right? You're hitting all the right keys, mother nature, supporting moms, supporting their income, helping children to be more responsible to, again, I think it, it, it's so important, right? Uh, because I personally has kind of um, went through this before as well because my mom gave me a pot of plant and then to watch it grow together as I grow is something I don't think anything can kind of can kind of can kind of replace it's very rewarding at that at the same time you know it's from your own effort uh, and yeah it kind of builds character in a sense so wow you're hitting a lot of a lot of keys there so without further ado I think uh, I'm very excited because I, I've just found out about this secret uh, that we're going to do. We're going to try to make um, this seed plant, right? This, uh, seed pots, right? Magic seed, seed pots. Seed pots together. So please, Rosen, please guide me through. Oh, okay. I see the, I see the blenders are coming. <laughs> I see all the materials are coming. So, okay. So guys, just bear with me, right? Everyone watching live internationally, Please take note of all this because you can do this, your kids can do this. And I know all of the IGL family members, right? You always like to get um, your kids involved. So, and hey, talk about going green, right? You can also educate uh, the young ones. So, okay, so what do we do? So I have some materials here now. I have uh, some blender as well. So big surprise, yeah, big surprise this. <laughs> okay, I have. Seeds as well, yeah? Alright, seeds. Okay, I got myself a chopstick. What else do I need? Oh, okay. Not forgetting, yeah? The mole, yeah? The mole. Okay, so what do I do now? Okay, first of all, the paper. I saw yes. the paper in the box where you already tear it into a small piece, right? Yes. yes. Okay, you need to soak this paper. Mm -hmm. You need to soak it at least for two to three days so that it becomes super soft. You soak okay. any paper, okay. even if you have an A4 paper or any kind of border puzzles, anything that has left over, that, but it should not be laminated. Right. Oh, should not be laminated. Yep. So yeah, you have a paper that's been soaked. Yes. So the paper should be soaked about two to three days in order for it to easy to blend. So you can put the whole thing into the blender. Right. Make okay. sure you have okay. enough water. Okay, put it all into the blender. Okay, I'm, well, as you can see, I'm not, I'm not a, a guy that cooks. So, bear with me, bear with me. Okay, so put all of this into the blender. Yeah, yeah. and yeah, put that in, maybe half okay. of it first. Oh, hold up. I think a mistake done by my part there. Let me, let me just fill, fill this in first. I'm not sure if the camera can see it, but a hey. half of it with a generous amount of water. Generous amount of water, yeah. Okay. Now water because it's papers, right? Your blender will start moving yep. left, right, center. So we don't want that to happen. <sighs> we don't want that to happen. No, 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 ma'am. No, no, we don't. Okay, half of it. Generous amount of water. Okay. There we go. Put it on top. Close it and you blend it. Okay, this is good. Okay, so far so good, guys. Bear with me. Okay, and we blend it. Okay, 
uh, warning eh, sound warning. Oh, a bit more water? Okay. One minute. More water. Okay, so that is definitely not enough. Ooh. Is this enough? More? A bit more? A bit more? Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. done. Try now? Okay. Let me close the and lid. you need to really blend the paper very fine. Very fine. Okay. So, off. I think I need to shake it a bit, right? Okay, I'm not sure if you guys can hear it because the blender was moving, right? But if if we want to have more, have have color, we can just if add some food coloring. If you want to have colors, you can add in food coloring into uh, this time during when you are blending it. Put it in mm -hmm. and then continue blending it another. You need to probably blend it about another two three minutes. Right, two three and, minutes. Uh, make sure the papers. Uh, yeah, two three minutes. Okay. Okay, guys. I think I think we'll. We'll skip this, yeah? We'll just move forward. Is it pretty yeah, good? I think it's pretty fine. Is. Okay, now take yeah? a bowl and pour this inside the bowl. Take a bowl. Really nice bowl here. Do you have a, is it an IGL bowl? Oh, no, 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 it's not. <laughs> okay, so now... Oh! Ooh, almost made a mess. So now that I have this, pour it into the bowl. Oh, it's almost like cement. Okay, now that we have this. So now that we have poured in uh, the mixture into the bowl, uh, what do we do next, uh, Rose? Okay, so now since you already poured the mixture into the bowl, you need to take out uh, a piece, make it a ball, squeeze okay. the water out, but okay. don't over squeeze the water, okay? Okay. Just try to make it a ball where you can feel that it's already been gelling together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Ah, yeah, that's good. That's enough. Okay, that's enough. Oh, it's a big ball. Okay. Put it in the mold okay. and you need to compress it. Okay. Is there a tip to kind of do this? Oh, put in the seed. Okay, one. Mm -hmm. One minute, yeah, while I'm just adding on. Cover it with another layer, then I give you the tips. <laughs> okay, so I'll just layer this in first, about half, yeah? About half, okay, very quick, guys, very, very quick. Okay. It's a oh, very, very oh fun my. activity to do with everybody in the house, even you it have is. elderly parents in the home. You know what? They need to have their hand massage. That is true, motor movement. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my god, that's so true. That's so right. And this Even is family can have, can sit and do this as an activity, right? Yeah, and I can I can see a lot of kids enjoying this. This is so fun. And this is like a a good bonding session between uh for, for you and your kids, right? You're busy working doing this and that right you're sending them to school and once they're back you don't really know what to do right except for cycling and things like that right you can do this i think this will be perfect for for kids and uh and parents to kind of kind of bond and get to know each other more right you know sometimes when you go to that teenage years right you kind of lose track this might help and summer school holidays now isn't it so a lot of parents yeah. probably going bonkers don't know what to do yeah this is an True. activity Okay, so now that I got my seeds, so, so I just put a few in? Yeah, put about three to five maximum. Don't over put the seed because then it will start growing next to each another. Then the plant won't be very healthy. Right, you don't want them to compete. Okay, great, great, great. Good tip there. Put a few here and there. Don't want too much. Okay, and now I'll just need to cover it, right? Just need to cover the 
thing. We just squeeze out more water. Oh, this is fun. I like this. We should have more of this kind of activity. <laughs> okay. Now putting it back on top, covering it. We get the audience to do it with us, okay? We tell them to prepare all the materials and then they can do it together yes. with us. Oh, oh yeah, we will need to create a few time zones, yeah? A few time zones. Oh, okay, this is great. Next, on top, lay it flat. Once you cover mm -hmm. the seat with the new layer mm -hmm. of paper, now uh, you take a cloth which can absorb okay. water. Take a cloth, one minute, do we have a cloth? We do, we do, one minute, yeah, okay, oh nice. Nice, okay, a cloth right over here, the IGR microfiber cloth. Then you put yeah, it yeah. on top of the mold and you press. Oh. So what are just you doing here is, you, yes, just press it in. So what are you doing when you're doing this pressing is you are actually compressing the whole paper into your mold. So you get a beautiful uh, picture the other way, you know, the flower, so that the, the, the sides are all covered, yep. it comes out beautifully. Yep. Yep. And at yep. the same time, you're taking out the excess of the water. It is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice. Oh, this is way, way, way better. Oh, that's a good tip, guys. Okay. And, and I see this as something very doable, especially for uh, for, 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 for single mothers out there that just came back, right, to the force, you know, trying to gain uh, sustainable income again, haven't really been uh, in the working space for some time now, right? So, wow, this is really doable. So easy. It's extremely easy. In a, yep, in a few minutes, you're done. To dry overnight. And if you mm -hmm. will just touch on top of it, if it's still moist, then you just continue drying it. At times, right, it takes about three to mm -hmm. four days. Especially during okay. this season when it's raining. So you can just leave it under the sun and then bring it in, put it under the fan or just, mm -hmm. just leave it around. Let it fully dry. Okay, one important thing is you need to ensure it fully dries. If not, it can sprout very fast. Oh, okay. I see. Yes, okay. So it needs to be fully, fully dry, right? Otherwise, you just have things growing out of nowhere. Okay. Okay, perfect. So leave it to dry for about three to four days. Yeah, three to four days. Okay, great. If it's really oh. good sun, then one day is fine. But if it's okay. not, then three to four days. Okay, guys. So yeah, again, make sure it's fully dry. Oh, it looks pretty good. Uh, my, the mold that I'm using is a Halloween mold, a pumpkin, if you guys can see. Yeah. So leave it to dry. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. look here, look here. Okay, we have something interesting. <laughs> you guys, can you guys see? Well, it's an IGL mold. Wow. I think your team did this for us. Yeah, I don't think our team has the expertise to do this, Rose. Yes, we did this. And thank you so much for trusting us and collaborating with us. It's always good to have our vision uh, and our objective aligned and I love it when sustainability was part of your objective as well and yeah we did this done by mother we had so much of fun doing it I remember my kids putting their hands so every single thing is handmade and my kids also were sitting down with me and doing it so it was a very awesome activity and this paper it took mm -hmm. us a bit more time because we needed to emboss the logo. So we wanted that to see, okay, I can see. Maybe yeah. I, uh, Ivan can show you nearer. So how do you actually, those who get this, right? I know they have a plan to give it out. Yeah. And whoever yeah. gets this, this is already, uh, the paper is already an agent to grow the seed. So all you need to do is just get a recycle cup, put the seed inside and start watching. Okay. See the seed growing after huh. one week. Once it grows, you just need to put it in the soil and then wow, water it, it and take care of your plant. Amazing! It's so simple, so straightforward. And yet, creating such a big impact, right? Wow! Wow, wow, wow. Okay. I noticed something very different, right? Uh, between this and, and, and the one we just made. How do you make the color change? It's white here. Yes, actually when you are uh, molding, remember the, the, the last tip that I gave you? 
and when you are actually yep. compressing Pressing it, it the back color comes out actually and the whole color goes down so that's where you get the beautiful shape of the of the green color down and out outside is white right okay interesting stuff so coloring guys if you want if you want to make this more fun for your kids right just get some food coloring okay great so food coloring yes always green be safe guys okay food coloring and and there you go that's how straightforward it is that's how simple it is uh, and yeah guys okay so i need everyone that's watching here right to just kind of try this out because i love it and i can only imagine right i mean your elderly parents or your kids right will love it too and this is also a way to support um yeah support not just women right but also oh, i want to say support women now if, if it's your daily if it's your own activity right this is a good bonding session right a good bonding session for you and your family and also for the earth now uh, let's move on with the series right other than this i think we are we are about there yeah this is the end of the 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 the, the live now uh, but before this uh can i just get a few uh, last words from 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 yourself rose if you have anything to share with our audience yep thank you so much for this beautiful session and march is not only earth day is also international women day celebration is going to happen on 8 of march and i am so glad to actually be here during this time and to every woman out there who's thinking i don't know what to do i don't know where to go i have no idea how to increase my financial capability how do i support my family in economical status do get in touch with mm -hmm. us at moms village asia you can actually find us in facebook instagram even in tiktok we are there and linkedin we are also there get in touch with us so that let us see how we can help you in that and when it comes to magic say guys rather than giving sweets unwanted gifts diabetic is on a rise so you don't want to give gift as the gift to anybody let's give them an eco-friendly gift which they can go back and plant and when the plant grows they can name this plant after you they would say i went for so and so birthday and i got a seed bomb i'm going to plant it and this tree is because of that a corporate gift that we can emboss your logo like how we just did for igl and we do orders as well we even can do packaging for you we can Ooh. customize how you want it to be so get in touch oh yeah one more interesting product that we just had which mm -hmm. we i was sharing just now with ivan uh that if you are getting married and you want to give a wedding invitation i would suggest you all to print your wedding invitation in on our plantable seed paper so that when they throw the paper a plant will grow rather than just a pure paper you see guys this is the innovation that comes with them right the community is just too strong it's so good right that so many ideas just pops and boom they do it right so what do you call that again plantable paper right plantable seed paper for a wedding gift card for a wedding invitation card ah okay so okay guys get in touch uh, if you want to know more get in touch and uh, i think we'll see you on the next live again uh, before we end the live session i want to thank our moms uh, village asia i want to thank you again rose for taking your time especially during this uh you know this whole pandemic thing right uh to be with us and to share this this is an amazing tip this is amazing amazing activity here <laughs> uh, and yeah if you haven't followed uh, both igl and moms village asia right do check us out in instagram facebook uh, maybe youtube uh, tiktok if there's any as well so follow us get in touch with us and we'll see you in the next live thank you everyone Thanks for watching and if you have any questions comment below and don't forget to like subscribe and hit that little notification bell and we'll see you in the next video